at six, a cheap shot during a Fitchburg State basketball game could cost the player his spot on the team. You can see there, he hit the opposing player so hard that he dropped right down to the ground. Yeah, Fitchburg State's investigating, and this may not be the end of it. WBZ's Ken McLeod is live in Fitchburg tonight with a story a lot of people are weighing in on, Ken. Yeah, Lisa, when a video like this goes viral, it does not do much for your school name. Now, Fitchburg State was quick to act today, but the visual evidence is pretty disturbing. There are not many folks on campus who haven't seen it yet. Oh, it's absolutely terrible. Glad he's out. He's talking about last night's basketball game here, where Fitchburg's Kiwan Platt flattens Nate Tanaglia of Nichols with a seemingly unprovoked forearm to the face just a second after the victim sinks a late three-pointer in a Nichols win. You should never be doing that in basketball. That's definitely like a bad name for Fitchburg. Indeed, despite Platt's quick glance to see if the nearby referee is looking, the other ref saw it and kicked him out of the game. And today, Fitchburg State went a step further, saying the school was appalled by the conduct displayed and that Platt had been indefinitely suspended from the team and barred from campus. It's definitely severe, but also what he did was severe. Fans at the game say Platt was upset that Tanaglia wasn't called for a foul on this play moments earlier, when Platt's three-pointer missed badly. While fellow students don't condone the forearm shiver, some do understand it. I mean, in sports that happens. It's, there's always ups and downs. People get frustrated. We've seen it in football and hockey and things like that from high schools and other sports teams, so I don't know. Though Tanaglia goes down hard, he was not seriously hurt. In fact, he played the rest of the game as his team won. Some Fitchburg students hope the ugly incident doesn't stain their school. It has no home here at this campus, and it has no home no one anywhere else. I mean, let me put it this way. Like, it's a game. We're told that campus police are looking into the incident. Now, the league Fitchburg plays in recently awarded Kiwan Platt Player of the Week honors. Today, they rescinded that award. Live in Fitchburg tonight, Ken McLeod, WBZ News.